Uh, now let's move on to Boys in the Hood. Ice Cube's debut film. Uh, you were still around for that, dog. So speak on, because right before this, it's music. You feel me? It's music videos, it's tours and shit like that. Now you're going from that to a movie set with your homeboy. You feel me? So what was it like being on the set of Boys in the Hood? The first, what was that, what was that experience like? You follow what I'm saying? Me, me, me personally, I was ignorant. I was ignorant. I was, I was happy. Uh, I was excited. One, one thing that I was really, really happy for, and this is the motherfucking truth, is that this nigga found his way in less than two years of being a solo artist, a way to break into the film industry, created this role, Doughboy, that was created by John Singleton, rest in peace. You feel me? And these niggas sold a film from a USC film student who got a little piece of paper, some change, and New Line Cinema took a deal and, and a chance with them niggas. And them niggas kicked off what was going to be known as hood cult classics, bro. Look how much shit followed after that. All right. All right. And so on the set of that, I was a young damn fool, smoking weed, laughing at Regina King, trying to be cool with her. You know what I'm saying? Looking at me alone, fucking with John Singleton, making him mad, telling him, telling Cube to tell me, tell JD to calm down. You know what I mean? I'm out there turned up, Cube cussing me out, nigga, go sit your ass down somewhere. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And it was cool. I, I, and the, me and Cube talked about this yesterday for Countess Most Wanted. He was in the movie. Eight was in the movie. Shoddy was in the movie. T Bone was in the movie. Uh, the Chill from Compton's Most Wanted was in the movie. Yo Yo was in the movie. That motherfucker kind of shined the light on all of us, bro. Right, 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 right. That's cool, right there, bro. I, I'm man. That's, that's so. Hey, hey, hey. So I got the Boys in the Hood DVD, and this is a deluxe DVD with a with a second part to it. And uh, this one ain't part of my question, but I'm going to ask you this because you're talking. So John Singleton gave a story about, uh, all right, let me ask you this. You, you, so you remember the scene from Boys in the Hood where they was on Crenshaw and Ricky had a little issue with the little blood niggas or whatever, right? And Q pulled a strap out like, well, so we got a problem here, nigga? We got a problem? Remember that shit? Yeah. yeah. And all of a sudden, the niggas started spraying the ooze up in the air, right? Yeah. And everybody took off running. Remember that shit? Yeah. All right, so John Singleton gave a description about that. This is what he said. There was a night when we were on Crenshaw. We were doing this big, wide scene with a whole bunch of people. Cube had some of the members of, of the then lynch mob hanging out and everything. And one dude came up on the set, you know, talking about this stuff, whoop de whoop de whoop de whoop And uh, some of the members of the lynch mob, they just rat packed him, mobbed him up, you know, pushed him out. He was like, I'm coming back, I'm shooting up the whole set. Fuck all y'all, I'm killing all y'all, right? potential this guy this kid may come back and start shooting everybody on the set and everybody's nervous anyway because of that you know and compounded nervousness says it can happen anyway and then the guy goes back to his car and shoots the Uzi up in there I didn't tell anybody that we were gonna shoot the Uzi I just did the whole thing and I told them when you hear something be ready to drive It was the first and only take, and that's what's in the movie right now. And so you, when you see everybody running, you see that real fear. And I remember him saying, too, that that was about as real as it was going to get because you can't recreate fear. Right, you know right. Saying? You can't recreate fear. And when they heard that Matt get to spin, and them niggas toe ass, motherfuckers thought somebody came back and got off. Right. Really? Right. And so motherfuckers <laughs> literally, motherfuckers literally screamed. And somebody said, "Wait, wait, wait! Cut, cut, cut!" 